Now, I, I know what you're thinking. This is not Ragnamod. Does it look like Ragnamod? There's water everywhere. What gives? So, here's the deal. Uh, I am going to start doing two packs. Welcome to FTB Ocean Block. Uh, this pack is actually what we have uh, on the uh, my Patreon server. Um, it is, you know, Ragnamon's a little bit more of an expert pack type thing. Uh, this is more towards everybody else. Uh, I've been wanting to play this pack. Uh, I didn't get to do any of the beta testing for it, um, which kind of sucked, but here we are. We're ready to go. It's going to be a fun pack. Uh, everything's different. Uh, we are here in the middle-ish of, we've got... He's gone. Uh, we're here in the middle of the ocean. Um, everybody else is out in the ocean. Um, we've got, ooh, we got a slime island right there, which is nice. Now, I've not messed around with this. I've looked at a few things. Um, we've got a lot of stuff in this pack. Uh, resource gen's different. A lot of stuff's different than what we're used to. And that's kind of the reason why, well, we'll talk about the reason why we're going to do two packs. One, Ragnamod is going to be a pack that's going to take me some time to do the episodes. Uh, there's a lot to it. Um, and it does get to the point where it gets to be an expertish style pack. Uh, we talked about that. Uh, so, this one's not quite expert. Uh, there is some grindy stuff towards the beginning of it, but it should be alright. And there's enough difference between the two packs that it should be... Uh, should go along rather nicely. So, but with all that out the way, I forgot. How you guys doing today? I hope you are doing well. I am. We're back. Uh, I, the, the, uh, I've, I've been playing. Uh, this is, I'm actually recording. This is Tuesday. This video will go out probably Wednesday. Um, but I've been, I've been grinding away at Ragnamod for about a week, uh, trying to get stuff taken care of with it. Uh, and decided to do this. So, nothing else. Let's get starry. Um, with all this. Alright, so. I got to talk to everybody. Um, it is time to get started. So, first thing we need to do is, as usual, we need to get us some wood. And we just so happen to have us a tree right here that has four logs in it. Uh, now, we do have Ultimine in this pack, uh, but it's not activated until we get going a little bit. So, let's do this. Oh, we actually got an extra one. All right, so that quest gives us an apple, gives us a random reward. It gives us elevators, which is nice. We are, what is this? campfire and a cooking pot nice all right so quest number one is complete uh of course our basic tools we need to craft uh the basic stuff so let's do that let's do i guess we need to just go ahead and do all of that two three one two three there's uh, some patterns I don't have my button set up yet. Um, so we need the Tinker Station. Well, we need a crafting table to do this. Uh, let's go ahead and just set this up right here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We got... There's chests everywhere. We've got barrels. I didn't see all that stuff. Uh, all right. Anyways, let's get to going with what we need to get going here. So there is a Tinker Station. Beautiful. We're going to need more wood. Let's get that uh, a going right quick. Alright, so next up on our list is our part builder. And with that, we should be able to now get... Our basic tools. So first things first, let's go ahead and just make us a pickaxe. Let's do that. 
Um, actually, we can use those to make a tool handle, a tool binding, and that should give us what we need for that. Beautiful. Pickaxe done. We're going to need, I just keep hitting my button. I need to fix that right quick. So that gives us more patterns and a part chest, which is nice. Um, so let's go with uh, a wooden hammer. We're going to need these guys. Wait, what was the... You know, one of these days... So there is us a wooden hammer that's going to do that for us. Uh, we'll make a better one once we get going with it. That gives us gravel. And, of course, next up we need to get string, we need to get rotten flesh, and we need to get um, anything. So we can just make us... Uh, let's see about getting us some cobblestone. Uh, we can get some right here. And we'll get us... An actual stone sword a kick in here all right so we want let's take this out let's do a tool handle let's take this out we want a small blade and what else do we need for the sword uh, two tool handles why not? That guy, that guy, that guy. Not got a whole lot of durability, but we do have us now a sword. And now we just need to get mobs. Um, so string, I'm going to guess we're not going to get from anything other than killing mobs. Uh, silkworms in here. They are not. So, string is where we are at now. So, one of the other things we got that we can do around here while we're waiting on all this, we've got all these little rafts. And in these rafts, we can... There's crates... Uh, that we can break and get stuff from them. Uh, some of them have good loot. Some of them have just, like, garbage loot. Uh, this one had a turtle egg and some glass. So, some of it's not necessarily bad. Um, so, but yeah, we've got that. We've also got wheat. And we need food. So, let's get that going. And then we will look towards getting our next quest done. All right, um, can we just make regular bread with this? We can. Beautiful, we got food. Well, we had food. All right, so a quest book. Um, so we got to kill some mobs. We got to wait till nighttime to do that. Uh, we need to get cobblestone, dirt, sand, and dust, uh, which is pretty much going to be just hammering all this stuff down. So let's, we've done this, let's get it done. All right, there we go. Quest, whoops, wrong button again. Uh, quest complete, that's going to give us some compressed cobblestone, and that gives us our ulti miner. Um, when active, it's active. Beautiful. We have trinkets. I love trinkets. Uh, all right. So we've got that taken care of. We're good to go. I need to fix some stuff right quick. Well, I got a boat. Uh, I'm running around here to the ones that are close. I'm trying to get some mobs to spawn. Uh, in uh on my island there uh we've got a creeper to spawn uh there is a skeleton on one of these uh but i'm trying to get some mobs to spawn so i'm uh 
just kind of making my way around here, opening some of these crates. I do have some of our string. Um, so, that's what I'm doing. Well, I got a, another trinket. Uh, I got to Miner's Pick. Um, and got some mana gear uh, out of one of these barrels but I'm still not having luck finding what I need and then I made the mistake of sleeping through the day so now we're kind of stuck trying to find a uh, string for what we need or crates for what we need uh, as far as swimming if you go underwater uh, our O2 disappears pretty quick um, we do have I did get an O2 tank uh, but it does not have anything in it um, so working our way towards, um, being able to stay underwater is a must. So, but for right this minute, let's go ahead and put, I got some seeds. Um, I've also went around, I've got flax growing, uh, but it's not growing very fast. Uh, like I said, it's a matter of just trying to get the seeds that we need for this and rotten flesh. Um, the rotten flesh, I didn't even look to see if there was a nah, zombie essence. Um, so we need zombies for that. Uh, we've got, I don't know how well a mob farm is going to work. Um, so we may wind up doing that uh, anyways. So anyways, I'm going to keep messing around. I'll be back. All right. So while I was out and about, I got some decent stuff. Uh, we've got another trinket. Uh, if we put one more on, then we're going to have to start using levels to do the next one. That one's for falling into the void. Um, we don't have a void. We have much water. Um, so, yeah, that's the thing. Um, so, we've got that. Uh, we've got a liquid trash can, which really doesn't do us a whole lot of good. And then we've got just some random stuff. I'm going to grow this here cacti. Um, that way, we've got one should we so see fit to need it um so my guess is we're gonna have to do the old mob farm the hard way which is fine no big deal um we can just throw all this stuff in here we'll keep the wood we're probably going to use wood to build this just because it's going to be uh the biggest resource that we've got that we can get right now um so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go out a way. Um, if we look at our map, we've got this guy this way. We've got the slime island this way. So I'm thinking, I don't know what this is. I'm thinking we may need to go check this out. Uh, let's sleep and we're going to go do that. All right, so before we take off and go, um, we'll see about making us a raft. I don't know if this is going to be any better for us. Are we headed out the right way? We need to head towards the southwest. That's this way-ish, maybe? Slime Island is there, so we need to head opposite of the Slime Island, which, okay, it's this way. See if this is any better. I've got some flippers. So we'll see how this works. Um, are we headed the right direction? We are headed the right direction. There's nothing on this island, or whatever the heck it is. We will head back. And we'll get the crates along the way. Ooh. What? This is going to probably be something that's going to kill me. But it does look really neat. I don't see anything... Black Barrel. No mobs are showing up on the map. There is a whole bunch of seaweed. I 
that give us we've already got that or we had already gotten it I got rid of it um, post box there's a crate right here or barrel right here more sea pickles Like, I guess it's just a tower full of stuff. Ooh. Let's get that. Sponges, some more wood. And... Some compressed sand, not necessarily too bad, but I don't see anything else around here other than some blocks. Anything on top? No. All right, well, that's a different chest. We need to head out that way and have a look. Let's get back downstairs. All right, this is a pulsating crate. What is it going to do? Please don't die. Or please don't kill me. Oh, nice. Ancient debris. Not that it does us a whole lot of good right now. Um, but we've gotten completely, like, way off track in our quest of what we were supposed to be doing. Uh, Northeastish, I do believe, is the way we need to head home. Um... This way. Now, there is something underneath us. I see it. That. And that looks impressive. Not today. Not today. All right, back home. All right, I haven't even took off yet. And I just happened to notice we've got a structure there. we got a structure over top of us. we got a structure there. There's another structure there. Um, so, yeah, we've got to get away for us to get under some uh, get underwater. Uh, so, but I'm hitting some of these crates on the way back home, just trying to see if I can get... We're not even going the right way. Um... Let's see if I can get the rest of our string. Then I can just make a mob farm for... I'm not even going to attempt to go down there and get that. Uh, I did that for the string that I do have, and it about killed me. Um, but yeah, I am in the process of making my way back home. So, I'll see you when I get there. Alright, so we're back. Um, I got a mob soul. Uh, we've got a bunch of other stuff. I got another miner's pick thing we've got this guy here uh i will take that magnet uh just because i like that one and now we maybe oh maybe we can just keep adding them to it i don't know uh we can find out right quick uh because i've got this guy here for we wither enemies um and I had one more somewhere, but I don't remember what I've done with it. Oh, yeah, the warm void. Beautiful. So it looks like we can just keep adding tickets. Oh, uh, we've got to actually turn them on. Uh, that's... Okay. All right, I forgot, completely forgot how to use the dang things. It's been a minute. All right, anyway, so that's parts done. We do have our string. I have not gotten... Rotten flesh. Um, Alright, so. Uh, our next bit of business. One is going to be... I just got a whole bunch of XP. Uh, David just stopped by. 
and handed me a, it's compressed XP. He handed me one of these. He got them uh, from a reward quest, and I got 6,000 levels from it, which is nuts. But we can unlock... Uh, are all of our trinket spots. Um, there is a lot of spots. A lot of spots. Uh, we'll stop there. Uh, anyways, we'll go ahead and add that one, and we'll just keep adding them as we go. Uh, so, but yeah, alright, so, um, like I said, quest, uh, we did not get, um, a rotten flesh just yet. I've got two of the three. We're also going to go ahead and upgrade our pickaxe. Uh, we can add, um, uh, we're going to be getting into getting iron here pretty soon. Um, which is the next bit of stuff that we're going to work on, which is going to be a, we need to get a bucket of water. Uh, we can get clay bucket. That's a regular bucket. Um, let's do a, a clay bucket, which is just three clay balls. And I've got those, um, because I did try, I did a, let's go over here right quick. Well, I'm thinking about it. Uh, I dug out a dark room. It's not a very big dark room, but I dug out a dark room. Uh, you have to be in a deep warm ocean, which we're in a deep warm motion. Uh, and still have not got um, anything. I've got two mobs spawn on this island, which was a spider uh, that spawned uh, on top of our crops and a uh, skeleton that wound up drowning. Uh, he got knocked off and he went for a swim. Uh, but the rotten flesh that I have, I got from a... Um, drowned that spawned like over here and that's all I've yet to be able to get anything else uh, but we'll get to that point uh, we've got what we need now to move on in about the pack so let's get us a bucket let's get us a bucket of water we've got it uh, so that is going to complete that quest, which gives us a, oh, we need to get 16 clay balls, which we should have some clay floating around here. If not, we can get, there's ways of getting clay. We will get into that, um, soon enough-ish. Uh, but for now, let's just do that. Uh, so that quest is complete now. That give us uh, some crates, which is nice. We've got storage galore, which means we've got all this little storage, which means it's going to get to be a mess pretty quick. All right, so our next bit of business is going to be to make a oak sluice, which is easy enough. Beautiful. And the next part is going to be a make mesh. The only mesh we can make right now is uh, string. We cannot get iron just yet. Um, so that is going to be easy enough. We need some stickets. And then we need that. And we've got that. So now we... Could start doing some sluicing. Beautiful. So that's going to give us that, that, and a reward. Uh, of course, it wants us to go up through. Um, but many resources that you would find underground are be gathered by chunks by processing basic materials in a sluice. Smelt the chunks into nuggets. Craft the chunks into clusters. Process them in a smeltery. Uh, or craft the chunks into cluster, cluster and melt them into ingots directly into a jar. As you expand your island, more ways of processing chunks will obviously become available. So, we need to get eight kind of ore chunks. Uh, manual pump. This guy we can not do yet. We've got to get water for it. Or not water, but iron. So, I'm going to assume that this works just like... Oops. Oops. 
Oh, we got to have water for each one of these. Uh, we need to get us some water here close for this. Uh, I tell you what, I'm going to do some work. All right, so I've done a little bit of clearing out. Um, we've got, whoops, there went my screen. Uh, I've got some ore nuggets. Uh, I did find out this thing will actually hold 12 buckets of water, so we don't have to just keep doing it one by one. Uh, but we do have a little bit of stuff. Now, we've got two options of how to do this. Um, one is we can craft these guys into chunks. And with these, we can put them in a tempered glass jar and do all that. But we can't do that yet. Or we can do uh, some Tinker's Construct with them. And with that we get the ore doubling. Uh, so that's probably the way we're going to wind up going. Alright, so I think the way we're going to wind up going is going to be to go with some Tinker's Construct. Uh, but we're not going to do that this episode because uh, we're already around the time. Uh, we do have a few quests that we need to complete. Uh, when you start the pack, the only thing that we have is this here uh, to get us started. At some point here, this unlocks everything else. Uh, but it does want us to get a ingot to complete that one. We'll worry about that come next episode. But I did get uh, this guy here taken care of. So we've got string. We've got gunpowder. I, I had a, another, while I was down here sluicing overnight, I had a drowned spawn on top of us. Uh, we also have exploration taken care of. We got a pulsing crate that give us a reward. It also give us a lava sigil. Oh, that's great. Uh, because we can use this, and this is going to hurt, um, unless it's changed. Uh, but we should be able to, yeah, it's going to hurt until we can get into blood magic. But we at least have uh, a way of getting uh, lava. We just got to make sure we've got food. That's it. Uh, all right, so that's that. Um got the one for breaking the black barrel which gives us a meat feeder which we don't have to worry about right now uh, a large crate uh, that's finding any lost trinkets that give us uh, a epic sh or it's an uncommon shader um, and now I have got everything I'm filled up here uh, that can go up for now but these small crates are actually very small uh, we can upgrade them. Uh, so, but that uh, we've also got storage uh, for getting a small crate that give us a, another small crate. Uh, storage drawers that gives us a, another big crate. Uh, we are not going to have to worry about crates at all. Uh, miscellaneous, we got wooden spikes from um, one of the crates. Now, my question is. Can I put this guy in here? No. I was hoping we could. All right. So, with that, that's all we got time for. Uh, we got... Oh, I got flippers, too. And the flippers are nice because I don't have to worry about holding shift while swimming. We can just swim around all we want to. There's another drowned. Uh, but we've got that. Uh, we off. We've got our first bit of ores. We just got to process, get them processed. We're gonna work back on that next episode. So with that, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.